What's happening people? Lo here. Today short clip or short video about the 49 mod, copper 49 mod by Tarshish Customs Philippines. I got it in the mail yesterday. I haven't really uh, cleaned them up good. There's a quick buff or polish, you know, to make it shine a little bit. It has six parts, six pieces all together. Although my 490 and 350 tube is, I think, the defective one that I got. As you can see, there's a groove, mm. like a connection joint, but it's just one piece tube. So, but uh, where I got it from, they said they're gonna take care of me, so I'll probably ship it Thursday or Friday back to them. Anyway, the bottom tube, the 490 and 350 tubes, the switch, the pinless top cap. And the magnet that makes contact to the battery and the switch. We will take the voltage drop as well on my all day vape 0 0.5, 0 0.6 ohm, but this one is 0.5 ohm, 502. Here we go. pin is just basically you you just kind of drop it in the mod and it will sit in the bottom what I do is I insert my finger so to just guide it while oh, it drops down otherwise you're gonna catch all the catch the sides and you're gonna be having trouble or problem pushing it down so there it is uh, 490 and 350 extension tubes Sony VTC4 this is uh, probably a couple of months old battery but I don't use it as much okay one more thing when I got the mod I put a battery in the magnet and the switch is sticking together so I'm kind of freaking out when I uh, use it I press the the button kind of pushing the battery up battery up to the connector when so so for it to fire so when you flip it upside down it'll fire automatically I didn't know that you can take it apart and flip the magnet that way it would make the resistance when you fire see so that's the magnets uh, doing the resistance again 0.50 ohm on my Patriot stopped air holes some says uh, button top or nipple top batteries are recommended but I've been using this with my VTC4 which is flat top just make sure your atomizer positive contact is sticking out at least half or one millimeter from the negative uh, 510 connector that way if it's even if it's the even if the battery is flat flat top it'll still make contact to the 510 pin my quasar I tried earlier and it just damaged my other VTC4 battery 
it won't charge anymore. So here you go. Get the voltage drop on this sucker. So you can see even my uh, voltmeter, the middle 510 pin is, is sticking out a little bit. Okay, here we go. What's that? 414. On a 0.5 ohm load, here's the drop. What's that? 392, 395, 391, yeah, 392. So that's 14, 0.28 volt drop on 0.5 ohm. The reason why I always get getting the uh, voltage drop on a 0.5 to 0.6 ohm load is because that's my all day vape and I am the one who's going to be using the mod. So whatever mod I get, I always get the drop on my all day vape setup which is 0.5 to 0.6 ohm. Okay. So that's that, 49 mm -hmm. mod by Tarsus Customs, Philippines. Shout out to Aloha Vapes for hooking me up. Of course my uh, lifetime supply of Vapeaholic. I'm going to give you a few rips on this 0.5 ohm setup single coil stock air holes uh, 0.34 millimeter omega wire four wraps on 2.4 millimeter drill bit omega wire flat and round wires twisted together precision twisted Stock air hole. Be a few bit. There you go. 49 mod by Tarsus Customs, Philippines. Cotton wheat. Hope you guys like it. Enjoy.